Now we got our fancy contraption here on our mini educator, so you guys can see exactly what I'm doing. And what I'm going to be working to do is I'm going to be working to get Mr. Magoo's perception level. Now, perception level doesn't mean it's his motivational level. It means it's his first level that he perceives it at. If your dog is concerned, freaked out, falling to the ground, or looking wide-eyed and worried, you're at too high of a level. This stuff is all about subtlety. I want you to take your time, and I want you to move slow. And if you're unsure about what you're getting, if, it's not, if you're not sure you've got the working level, start back at zero, take your time, and work up. There's no rush to get this. Better to do it solid and right than to try and rush through it and, and do it kind of half-assed. Here we go. We're going to start at one. I'm going to press and hold, and I'm going to look for the most subtle reaction, which tells me that he's actually sensing it. Dialing up, press, hold. I'd be very surprised if any dog felt it at two. You could get the occasional anomaly, but... Now, here's the other thing is you can hear the buttons clicking a little bit. So a lot of times dogs will look up at the buttons and you think, wow, maybe they're feeling it. But that's three and that would be highly unlikely if he was. So now I'm going to hit four. Right, so you see his ears moving, but his ears really seem to be moving in conjunction with this. Now that I can see. Now, so uh, it's a real subtle thing, guys, but I'm at five, and what I'm seeing is just the teeniest, teeniest motion out of his neck going like this, right? So he's not blinking, he's not bothered, he's not freaked out, he's not worried, but I can see just a tiny little, right? And so with a lot of these guys, if you start getting up into the higher levels on a mini educator like this, say 10, 12, 15, and you're not getting a response, I would double check your collar fit, I'd double check, make sure it's turned on, and then I would also stand and I would watch the receiver box and see if you see the dog's neck moving at all, doing any kind of fluctuation when you press the button. That can be another tell. Some of these stoic guys won't give you any tell other than that, so that would be a perception level where you'd get started. Let's watch again. Watch Magoo's head as I tap the button. See that slight head tilt to the right? That is one of the possible signs that indicate you have found your dog's perception level.